Hello and welcome to Turner Time Tutorials. This video is on creating and using Quick Parts in Outlook 2007. Quick Parts help you to reuse content in documents or email messages by creating and using building blocks. In this example, I have an email that I have created. I frequently use the conference call dial-in information in emails throughout the week. So in order to save time and become more efficient, what I want to do is save this selection of text as a quick part. To do so, highlight the text that you'd like to reuse in the future, left-click on the Insert tab, and left-click on the Quick Parts button. There's only one option available right now. I have not used Quick Parts in Outlook before. So I'm going to left-click Save Selection to Quick Part Gallery. A Create New Building Block dialog box will open, and Outlook's automatically going to use the first portion of the text that you have highlighted as the name. I'm going to erase this and rename it. The other selections in the dialog box are automatically filled in by Outlook. I'm going to leave those as is and left click on OK. If I were to create a new email and I'd like to use the quick part that I've created, you want your cursor to be at the point where you'd like to insert the quick part. Left click on the Insert tab. Left click on the Quick Parts button. You can see the quick part that I saved is displayed at the top. As you add quick parts, they will all be displayed in the selection menu. Left click on the desired quick part that you'd like to use, and the text is automatically inserted in your email. By using the Quick Access Toolbar in Outlook 2007, we can save a few steps. Left click on the Insert tab, and right click on the Quick Parts button. The top selection is Add to the Quick Access Toolbar. Now when you open up a new message and you need to use a quick part, it's no longer necessary to left click on the Insert button and the Quick Parts button. Simply go to your Quick Access Toolbar, left click the Quick Parts icon. The same selections will be available. Left click the Quick Parts that you'd like to insert into your email. The Quick Part is inserted and you're all set. Please see online tutorials for additional videos on working with Quick Parts in other Office 2007 and 2010 programs. If you have any questions, please email info at getturnertime.com. Thanks for watching and have a productive day.